We are going to briefly describe your options and the installation process when building a new patio or driveway. We will go over cost, beauty, performance, maintenance, and expected life of the installation. The first material we are going to go over is concrete. Everyone is pretty familiar with concrete. It can be mixed by hand or come out of a truck. The dry concrete material is mixed with water until it reaches a mud-like consistency. When installing concrete, there are five main steps. Dig or excavate the area, build the form, rebar, pour the concrete, and finish. All construction costs are directly proportionate to the time it takes to install the project. A job can have conditions such as bad access to the installation area, or excavation problems. With this in mind, we're going to use 2012 prices for a project with normal conditions, which means your project could be a bit more or a bit less. The average cost for an installed concrete patio or driveway is $7 a square foot. Natural concrete that is installed is a light gray. Color can be added to the concrete to add beauty, but the color is hard to control and doesn't always match. Colored concrete usually adds about $1.50 to $2.50 a square foot. Concrete can also be stamped, creating the look of real stone. This is referred to as stamped concrete. It usually adds $1 to $3 a square foot. Concrete is prone to cracking. This is due to the fact that A, concrete expands and contracts during the setting process, and B, tree roots and earthquakes will cause concrete to move. Concrete is porous and will stain due to oil and spills which are hard to remove. Cracks can be repaired with additional concrete but will be noticeable. The life expectancy of a concrete installation is about 20 years, after which concrete or another paving material will have to be installed. Now we are going to talk about paving stones. Each paving stone used on a patio or driveway installation is compressed concrete, which makes it four times stronger than regular concrete. When installed properly, they interlock, forming a paving stone system. The steps for a paving stone installation are dig or excavate the area, compact four inches of class two road base, add one inch of sand, lay the paving stones, cut the stones for the border, Set the concrete border, compact the stones, sweep sand into the joints, and finish by compacting the area again. Paving stones add beauty and value to a home. There are many styles, colors, and patterns giving you the option to match your design to the style of your home. The interlocking system distributes weight and pressure evenly throughout the paved area, which is why properly installed paving stones will not crack or buckle. If a paving stone is stained by oil, it can easily be extracted and replaced with a new stone of the same type, making repairs seamless and unnoticeable. For extra protection, sealer can be applied. This usually adds about $1.15 a square foot. Once again, based on normal conditions and 2012 pricing, paving stones generally run $8 to $15 per square foot, which includes removal of the old driveway or patio, materials, and labor. 